So you've had your Prusa i3 Mark III for a while now, and it's been really great. Until suddenly one day, it just stops in the middle of a print. With a print fan error. But you check, and the print fan is still running. What the hell? So you go into the menu, and you select Resume Print. And everything's fine, and it prints for a little while, and then stops again in the middle of the print. What the hell's going on? So what exactly is going on here? Well, in my case, it was an intermittent fault in the wire bundle that comes out of the back of the extruder. So what happens is, while the extruder's on the left-hand side of the carriage, the wires come out pretty much straight. As it's printing, though, and it goes off to the right, it has this relatively drastic bend to it. And it seems to get the it seems to bend the worst right as it exits the support here. Now this spiral wrap here is good for keeping wires together to keep a bundle together, but it's not a strain relief. Because as you can see here, it wants to bend sharply in between the spirals. So as this print head's going back and forth, you're getting a sharp bend in one spot over and over again. So what happened is the conductor inside one of my fan wires uh, severed inside the insulation and just gapped a little bit. So what happened is it was actually touching when it was printing things over here or towards the middle, but on bigger prints, when it was stretched further, it would actually separate inside the, inside the insulation and the fan would shut off and this thing would do the print error jigger. So, but when I would move it back over here and begin to print again, the fan would run and everything would be fine. It was a little weird. But intermittent faults, you know, you know it's a wiring thing usually, and then you know it's going to be at a bend point. So what I did to diagnose it, so I went down to settings, to temperature, fan speed. Spun this for about a year until it maxed out at 255. So as you see now, the fan is spinning. And what I was noticing is the fan would spin over here, but as it came over here, no spin because of that severed wire in the back. So what I did was cut these two tie wraps, undo the spiral wrap to about here, and then started playing with the fan wires. And I found out that it was acting funny right where it came off of the this, uh, support here. Um, so in order to fix it, I had to um, cut the fan wire about you know where it was still supported and cut it. I cut it back about here and I spliced in a length of uh, servo extension wire, which I had laying around because I'm into RC models and stuff like that. Um, and, you know, it fixed it. All better. Everything's happy. So the problem is, I'm pretty sure this is going to happen again because the wires are going to keep bending right here. And maybe pretty soon other wires are going to snap off and break. Um, so what I did was I designed and printed this um, strain relief and hopefully it works. So the idea is it just, I'm going to take this the two tie wraps off. It mounts down on here, like so. Uh, two tie wraps go back, maybe another tie wrap up here, and this will help alleviate in a, this sharp bend here. Um, how it's designed is it's thick, starts off thick and it gets thinner and thinner. So that'll help give it a nice contour as it bends. Let's hook it up and see what happens. First thing we do here is cut the tie wraps off a little. Ah, like a glove, like a glove. Look at that.
Oh yeah, that's the ticket. See how nice that is? Okay, our repair is all done and hopefully that was helpful to you. If you do have the same problem and you're interested in the strain relief, I uploaded the file to Thingiverse. I'll leave a link to it in the description and you're welcome to download it for free. All I ask in return is that you check out my website, briankramerbooks.com, and if you're into science fiction novels, check them out and eh, maybe buy one. Well, anyway, that's it for now, guys. I'll talk to you later. Cheers.